Okay, so uh, this is a plane of Ada Lovelace that's floating in my living room. Um, I'm using uh, a frame with an AR extension over 3.ar.js, um, and I created a normal and a diffuse map, which is why when this light passes through, uh, you can't see the light. Um, when this light passes through, um, animates up and down, uh, you can see the light catching on bits of Ada's clothes and her hand and uh, her eyes and her chin. Um, and yeah, I. what's actually happening is that there's a really strong light coming from, from behind. Um, so we can actually, one of the cool things about AR is that we can actually walk behind and uh, oh, hold on. Okay, so we can actually see that there's a much stronger light from behind here. And uh, you can actually see a reverse of the uh, shadows because of that normal, um, normal and diffuse map. And so kind of looks like she's embossed or something, uh, which I think is just a really interesting effect. And yeah, I just wanted to show this off as a potential technique um, for doing physical, um, or at least as a proof of concept for doing physical, physically based rendering uh, in an AR scene using web technologies.